No bat. This is my cheese. That's it. Hey everybody, Madman999 is back in Zelda Twilight Princess walkthrough. In the last episode, we collected all the tears of light from Kakariko Village, but then we have to go get some from Death Mountain. We have to go get the tears of light. Yes, the tears of light were spread out in Death Mountain. Some enemies over there, just blow by them. The sign, but I believe the sign says like Death Mountain ahead. I'm not gonna check it though. Don't worry about signs. Even those signs are helpful. All right. So it looks like there's a spirit of a Goron up there. Me as Gorons always live in Death Mountain. I don't like the uh, tears of light from Death Mountain. They're too spread out, as you can see. They make like a big Y, or more so just an upside down triangle. Evil fish. Features. Alright. So we're getting close to the uh, one from over here. Alright. And there's a howling stone up there. I believe it'll teach you the shield attack. The shield attack doesn't do any damage despite it being called attack. I don't like these things take way too long. I love when you see this because then you can see like pretty much the whole. You can see pretty much like the whole, whole area. It's like you see Death Mountain like right where we are with all the beautiful lava graphics. And then it looks like we got some uh, icy mountains over to the right. And uh, looks like we have some grassy plate, a, a grassy place over there. So you, so it might be a little bit obvious where where it's gonna be. Oh, it looks like we're in a grassy place too. Yet we're in a evil tense lava place. Yet we're just grassy plains. Take sword in hand and come over here, and we can have a party. Pick up some high school chicks and you know show up, show off our skills with swords. So yeah, there we go. It looks like it's back in uh, Ordon. Ordana, sorry. Or no Ordon, sorry. The light spirit is Ordana. Oops. All right, crates. No, we have $120, that's easy enough to remember. Two more, uh, oh, we're at Death Mountain now, but now, uh, as if it weren't obvious. Four of them, I'm too lazy to kill all of them. Caged like the animal I have be no singing. I have no singing ability. Yeah, like the last day of school was a couple days. Last day of school was like two days ago for me. And so we had these class favorites thing handed out at the end of the day. And they took off the best singer award. I mean, I was so gonna win it. No. <laughs> I wound up with the funniest big surprise. Yeah, it actually, it actually kind of was. Okay, so. Alright. 
or it looks like there's one over here. There's one down there, but I can't remember how you get back up. Alright, so I think there's one over here. Hey! Hey, you! So now we can go get the one that we blew by earlier. Or that I blew by earlier. I was almost I was almost blaming you guys for my mistakes. Like that's what my parents accuse me of sometimes. Like you always blame somebody. Cause last time they said that is like I was at a baseball game. I was actually playing in a baseball game. Oh whoops. Wrong wrong way. I deserve that. I should have taken damage from that, because yeah, you don't take damage. Yeah. So we need to get up there, which I kind of, oh, yeah, that's right, we go over here. <laughs> As I said in either like one of the last episode or the episode before that, I'm gonna split episode uh, 15 into three parts, because it's, you know, that's when we're, there's a ledge there? Apparently I was. Oh. I thought you were the tier of light. There we go. I don't care about you fish things. I don't care about you French fish from Russia. Mm. I want the light, I want you back in the ra- I want to be a regular birdie like everyone else. The vessel of light and full of tears and light has returned to this area. The sun came up and it smiled at me. It's the best day ever. Wow. I'm sorry. There's the phone that I warned you about in the first episode. Just ignore it. I'm not going to ignore it like I... I'm not going to go check it out like I did in the, like, whatever episode. Alright, this is the light spirit that was actually based off one of the goddesses. Because if you notice in my tags, if you actually look at those, I put the light spirits in the goddess, because here's El Din. He is an, he's probably, he looks like an eagle, either a combination of a baboon or an eagle. The dark power you seek lies in the sacred grounds of the proud mountain dwellers. Okay. You must go and you must go to those sacred grounds and cleanse them. Cause we have Eldin, Lene Rue, and Farun. Oh yeah, you had Farun. Because Farun was based off of Faror. Eldin was based off of Din and Lene Rue was based off of Lanayru. Wind Waker was a good game just because you you know you collected the pearls and Oh yeah that reminds me it's like what if Jaboon said no in the Wind Waker it's like Jaboon we've collected both the pearls and now we're going to and now we're going to defeat Ganondorf. No Jaboon it's night out it's been night 24 7 365 No it's my fault I'm not gonna give it up Poor Colin. You guys, it's not like you guys are gonna grow up to be the link from Skyward Sword. Colin, you're my favorite. Randy Moss, can I have your autograph? I don't want your autograph, mask guy, because I saw what you did in the. <laughs> what an idiot! <laughs> Spit out something on my leg because you know I'm like sitting down. That was that was gross. I'm sorry. All right, so looks like we're gonna end things off. So in the next episode, we're gonna try go to Death Mountain and try to get the you know 